All over the world, DaVinci Resolve is used for color grading more feature films, episodic television productions, commercials, independent films, and music videos than any other system. Now, with DaVinci Resolve 14, color grading is faster, more creative, and more collaborative than ever before. All of the color correction and color grading takes place on the color page, which is organized with the colorist's workflow in mind. The timeline located in the center of the screen is divided between a thumbnail strip, which shows every clip in the current program, and a mini edit timeline, which auto selects the current shot as you move the playhead. The viewer dominates the top of the screen, showing you the image going to your video monitor. On the right is the Node Editor, which lets you combine multiple adjustments and effects together to create unlimited creative looks. The gallery on the left saves your looks along with a reference still. You can use the gallery to compare shots or for copying saved grades to the current shot. The bottom of the screen contains all of DaVinci Resolve's powerful color correction tools organized into a series of palettes. There's even a keyframe editor for dynamically animating grades and built-in scopes so you can monitor the video signal as you work. Even before you begin color grading, you can convert all of your source media from different capture devices into a single, common output color space using Resolve's project color management. All you have to do is highlight the source clips, select their color profile, and Resolve will update them all to match a common output. That means colorists can begin grading right away without managing LUTs or worrying about highlight clipping because every clip is represented accurately with greater precision, no matter what device they were captured or created on. The starting point for color correcting is to balance each shot. The Shot Match tool lets you quickly match shots from different cameras, angles, and even different lighting conditions. Simply select the shots you want to match, and then tell Resolve which shot you want to match them to. This is a super fast and easy way to give you a good starting point for creative grading. DaVinci Resolve's color wheels let you make corrections to the entire image, so it's easy to add warmth or coolness to the shadows, midtones, or highlights. You can also modify the tonality in a shot, creating deeper shadows or brighter highlights. Alternately, the Primaries bars lets you make the same kinds of primary adjustments using independent RGB color sliders in Lift, Gamma, and Gain regions, but it also allows for independent luminance controls in each channel. Tint and temperature adjustments provide a more controlled method of correcting common warm cool or off axis color balance issues. The center palette includes a variety of incredibly flexible curve based controls that can be used to sculpt contrast and color more specifically. The custom curve is useful for making tonally specific adjustments in each color channel or the Y luminance channel. When your color grading becomes more ambitious, you can turn to resolve sophisticated secondary color correction tools to isolate areas of the image. The Hue vs. Hue curve lets you adjust color in a more specific way, making it simple to isolate a narrow range of hue in a shot and then shift that hue to another color, like making this red plane magenta. Compared to the original shot, it is easy to see how just a few quick adjustments make all the difference. Qualifier's palette contains a collection of keying tools that are useful for isolating trickier areas based on luminance, green or blue screen, or even skin tones. For instance, just by drawing over the image, Resolve's 3D keyer does a fantastic job of isolating the selected trees. Or, using power windows, you can isolate an arbitrary object in the shot by drawing a spline-based shape. Once in place, you can track all the object's movement over time. Resolve includes a full 3D tracker that can track objects even when their perspective changes.
Once the track is complete, you can correct hastily drawn areas of a power window. The rough spline shape can be modified by moving a single control point, or you can select groups of control points. Using the transform box, you can move, scale, or rotate multiple points at once. The node editor is used to assemble primary and secondary corrections together to create full multi-correction grades. Each node can have color correction, power windows, and effects. The node view makes it easy to copy, extract, and insert nodes, making it easier than ever before to create and modify the node tree. If things get too crowded, you can lasso multiple nodes and collapse them into a single compound node. Then you can simply view inside the compound node or decompose it to see the entire node tree. You can even lasso multiple nodes so you can pan, move, and delete them all at once. To easily work with HDR clips, Resolve includes an option that enables grading tools to work in an extended dynamic range for HDR deliverables. DaVinci Resolve 14 Studio also includes over two dozen indispensable and creative filter effects like blurs, light rays, lens flare, abstract, and watercolor. Resolve FX can be quickly dropped onto any node, modified, and played back using GPU or CPU acceleration. The new face refinement tool in DaVinci Resolve 14 Studio is essential for every talking headshot, whether it's a feature film or a corporate video. Analyzing the clip finds individual facial features. Areas for the eyes, mouth, cheeks, forehead, and chin are automatically tracked throughout the shot, so you can isolate and enhance different facial features without ever having to rotoscope a single frame. You can quickly go through a shot to smooth out uneven skin tones, use the eye controls to add back detail, and brighten the area with an eye light. You can even remove dark shadows under eyes, add color back to lips and cheeks, and soften wrinkles in the forehead. It's a powerful tool that you'll find indispensable in every production. DaVinci Resolve 14 Studio also includes a new warper tool, allowing you to add points in a frame to pull areas into alignment or push areas out of frame. Additional points can protect areas that you don't want warped, so you get the shot you want without unwanted artifacts. Additionally, the dehaze filter makes it incredibly easy to remove atmospheric haze or glare on windows. You can control the strength and even determine the tint in the haze you want to remove. If you have a set of Resolve FX filters you use often in every project, you can mark them as favorites, making them easier to find and apply next time. Resolve's unique versioning system lets you create as many versions of a grade as you like. This makes it easy to recall a grade for an indecisive client. And after creating a few versions, you can easily compare them side by side in the split screen view and simply click the one you want to use. Once you have a grade you want to keep, you can save it to the gallery. You can even compare your saved gallery grades on a shot to see which one looks the best. To find certain types of clips on the color page faster, you can use the smart clip filters to sort shots using metadata, like keywords. Once created, custom smart filters are added to the drop down menu so you can quickly find shots that match the search criteria whenever you need them. You can then group shots together to make grading entire scenes faster. Changing the look of one clip in the group updates all of them automatically, including power windows and color correction. Using the Groups menu, you can easily switch from making adjustments to the group to making adjustments on an individual clip.
When working with wide dynamic range RAW clips, Resolve's Camera RAW palette provides access to the specific controls for each of the different RAW formats. You can correct clips by changing the camera's ISO or the exposure, as well as other RAW processing adjustments that can help recover detail in highlights and shadows. Grading isn't just about color and contrast. Powerful spatial and temporal noise reduction makes it easy to clean up noisy shots while preserving crucial image detail. The spatial noise reduction includes a superior, multi-GPU algorithm, while temporal noise reduction can use an expanded frame range so you can tackle the noisiest of clips. Reframing shots is easy. And with Resolve's optical quality, resizing the reframe sequences always looks great. In addition to the traditional pan, tilt, zoom, and rotate controls, you can also adjust pitch and yaw for even more creative options. DaVinci Resolve's legendary image quality and massive yet approachable toolset make it the first choice for professional colorists and editors everywhere.